this type of stuff, these sacrifices, a lot of people don't know the background. They see, y'all see what we put out there, but at the end of the day, the background of what we go through, it's really tough. And we do our best to achieve the goals we want. And at the end of the day, ain't nobody going to stop us. I don't, nobody. We, we, on the, we on the grind. This is money and everything. No matter what it is, we is on the ground. We, you got to want as bad as you want to breathe, like he said. And at the end of the day, we're going to keep going. And so if you don't believe in us, um, hey, we'll make you believe in us. But at the end of the day, support us and keep and keep it going, you know. Because we're we going to support you regardless. You know, we, we that type of people. We'll support you, but and they support us. That's how we look at it. And I just want to say thank you to the people. People, family, friends, who out there support me right now. Because this right here... This started as a job, as a hobby and job for in Grand Rapids when I went there, but mm -hmm. you know, but it became personal after the after a while, and um, I just want to say thank you to the people who real deal started this with me. They may not be doing it with me, but I want to say thank you to you all because if it wasn't for you all, I, would, I wouldn't be doing this. Like I said, this became personal. I became athletic with it. Uh, I fell in love with it, and uh, I just feel like I can take it to a whole nother level. Like, maybe, like, that what if. Like, I wasn't scared if that what if. What if I just jump in head first? What would happen? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And and it happened. You know, I'm ranked number two in amateur kickboxing in the world. And I won karate. <laughs> right, I'm ranked number two in karate, <laughs> karate in Michigan. Don't forget it. <laughs> uh, I placed last year, last year in that. So, 22. I'm 22 years old. The numbers don't lie, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> numbers don't hey, lie. Hey, numbers don't you know, lie. Twenty two and he ranked two and two. Oh, everything shit. happens for a reason, you know. Everything. And I and belief. Belief will change your world. You have to see it. That is part of law of attraction. You have to see it and believe it. A lot of y'all might discredit that. I don't I don't care. You can't go go right ahead and discredit that. But it worked for me, because my belief got me here. Me seeing it, me having a vision. I have a vision. You don't have one. And you got to have a vision if you want to get to where you want to be at. Because a lot of y'all are down here. You need to be You need to be up here. I'm not I'm not cocky. I'm humble. I always tell people thank you. And if I didn't get to you, I'm sorry. I promise I will get to you when I can. If I don't, don't hate me for it. You know, don't hate, don't hate us for it. You know, but every last one of you, I appreciate the support. Uh, I appreciate the love. And like I said, my, my whole mission here... It's not only prove anything to myself, but I'm just trying to show every last one of y'all that this is possible. Anything, anything is possible if you really want it. You know, if you can see it, you can have it. It don't matter what the field might be, you can have it. And I believe in that 100%. That's what got me to this point today. Like I said, I work third shift at nights. I sleep in my car before I even leave work so I can even get back home. But usually when I sleep in my car, I'm going straight to practice right after that. After that nap, you know, I'm taking a two, three hour, four hour nap mm -hmm. so I can just get back 45 minutes back to my my hometown to go train. You know, a lot of people don't even know that part. And um, usually I'm training two or three times a day because I want it as bad as I want to breathe. I need this because I don't have nothing else. This is this is all I got, you know, and some of y'all have one thing and that's all you got. But you got to realize if you just you got to be willing to die for it. You got to be willing to sacrifice for it. What I'm doing is not it's not phenomenal. This is not incredible. A lot of y'all might think that. It's not ah, 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 he's yeah. doing ah, you know what I'm yeah. saying, but it's not. A lot of hard work went into this. A lot. A lot of hard work and a lot of sacrifices, but you got to be you got to be consistent and yep. you got to have execution. You got to. You got to. Hey, you know what? Um I just say this, you know, you, you got to stop. You Y'all got, got to believe in yourselves, man. You got to stop now. It, we just met a guy. We, I can't remember his name. But this guy just told me in Bahati something that was just amazing to us. You know, and this guy, he didn't he didn't place in nothing, didn't win nothing. Um, but the, what he already won a battle before the battle started. <laughs> yeah. He had a fraction leg. He had a... a, a his... He had a broken uh, orbital. A broken, yeah. Uh, and messed eye. up his eyeball. His his pupils was messed up. I, yeah, his, his it was disc. one of the fighters that we met downstairs. His Just, disc. Oh, he had a um. It was ah a, man. Something dealing with his spinal cord, but 
long, long story short, you know, this guy, he he didn't even supposed to be out here, but he believed in himself. Now, if that don't tell you something right there, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you, you know. So believe in yourself. Stop stop worrying about, you know, the what ifs. Or, no, or I can say, stop worrying about what's next and just start, you know. Stop saying, oh, I can't do this because I don't have the support. I don't have that motivation. Every, believe it or not, our motivation start with each other or ourselves, you know. Every self-motivation will take you further than anybody else motivates. You can only motivate yourself. But at the end of the day, more motivation only adds to the fight. That's what it does. But um, enough uh, to change it up a little bit. Uh, I'm, if people always want to know how me and Bahati, how we met and stuff, you know, little things about that. Uh, me and bro go way back. We go, <laughs> we go way <laughs> back. <laughs> I mean, it all, I don't know how far Ooh. we go back, but we, we so close. It's ridiculous. We got history with each other. It's just like, this right here was just amazing. I remember the day we called each other just saying, Bro, we got, I got, I was like, bro, it's a tournament going on. And he was like, what? And then he was like, I told him where it's at, and I told him it's in Florida. He was like, let's was, sign up. That was like, what? Six months ago. Seven. Seven months. Like, you told me about that in like January. Oh, I'm yeah, like, about January, yep. And then you were just like, oh, I bet. Then that's when I was like, we need to sign up. We put to sign up in April. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> and then I said, let's sign up next month. Then we ain't signed up that month. Then we kept waiting month after month. We finally signed up the, the month before, like four weeks before the actual event. I think you signed up like six weeks before, and I signed up at the very last minute. And I was like, bro, I don't think we'd be able to do this event, but some odd reason, I didn't have, we didn't have no money, but I don't know how it happened, but miracles. If it's meant, it Believe. would happen. Yeah, honestly. Believe. Bro called me and said, Chuck, write it on a piece of paper. You put it on that piece of paper, put it on that refrigerator. I put, well, I got a little son, so I put his little alphabet letter there so he can say stuck to the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. But every day, if I open that refrigerator and go grab a soda, I know that letter. I was like, wait a minute, I, this, I'm going to be blessed with this money. So, I, And it somehow happened, and I ended up coming out to this event. I mean, I didn't place where I want, but I performed like I want, and I feel happy. We feel happy. We, we did it. <laughs> you know, we, we the first people from Saginaw, Saginaw. that to try to make a run at this, you know. <laughs> and you rank number one in point kickboxing karate. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's that's a huge step. And I'm just and I'm ranked number two in kickboxing. But how many of us can say we made it to that? I mean, point time? kickboxing karate. <laughs> my my correction. But um, uh, but a lot of people ain't ain't make it here. It was a lot of people that was in my division. A lot of people ran. They dropped out. They didn't want to do it. They 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 told themselves they couldn't do it. But I didn't tell myself that. Yep. I believed I could do it. I knew I could do it. Yes, well, it was a lot of you out there that looked me in my face. And I, I'm not going to call names, but it was a lot of you that looked me in my face. And you ain't have to say it, but I seen it in your eyes and you knew I couldn't do it. And your disbelief made me believe just to prove you wrong. Yeah, just to prove you wrong. And now I'm here. So next year I'll be coming back. But not only next year I'll be coming back. I got other stuff lined up right now. There's a great man. possibility me and Chuck could be fighting in Las, Las Vegas. Vegas baby. <laughs> Las, Las Vegas, Vegas in October. That's a, that's a phenomenal opportunity, you know. But everything's being ironed out, and if that if that don't happen, there's more opportunities yeah. to come because yeah. I believe that it can happen. California, <laughs> Cali, baby, Cali. We ain't gonna tell y'all. Yeah, we ain't, we ain't gonna, gonna tell y'all the rest. There, what's but. about to really happen? Sometimes but, when you tell people too much, then they saw a plot and they hate Right, it, so. they already hating. So. You, you shouldn't hate because <laughs> you can do whatever you want to do. You can do whatever you want to do as long as you have a vision, as long as you have belief. That is part of the law of attraction, knowing that, is, that you, you already have it before you get it. You, you have don't to... believe in that law of attraction, anybody who don't believe in that, I'm sorry, y'all need to... <laughs> Y'all missing out on the world, man. Y'all, y'all, y'all gotta start thinking about. Y'all so caught up in this popularity thing and thinking that's it, that's over with, and everything. Like, no, nah, man. Y'all need to y'all leave that leave that popularity stuff alone. And just realize something, man. The world is too big, to where too small for you to not know enough. Y'all, y'all limit yourselves because y'all want this. Y'all don't want that a certain image or whatever, but. Forget all that. If me and him would have been worried about that certain image, we wouldn't be who we are now. 
And now I'm not saying we know we somebody, but we wouldn't be in a position we in now as far as who we are in the inside. Yeah. Cause uh we we not we're not scared to express our feelings as far as you know, being humble, being nice, shaking your hand. We would we would tell you we love you, but a lot of y'all won't. Because y'all don't want nobody to look at y'all like, you know, whatever y'all call this, but uh this new swag stuff, whatever, but <laughs> you know. <laughs> But anyways, you know, believe in that, man. Law of attraction. If you don't believe in that, I don't know what to say. It's real. <laughs> it's real. It got us hit. Like I said, you those who don't believe, <laughs> you're right. Those who don't believe, you are exactly in the same position you are at right now. Look what law of attraction got me. <laughs> Look what it got us. <laughs> look it got it. us here. It got us here to this point. Wait, tell them how many trophies you won. Look, at, look what law of attraction. Look at that. If you don't see this, I don't know what. <laughs> Oh, uh, that's a glass plaque. Man. A glass, and that's oh. not even like the even like, like the stunt or not, not, you know no, BS like no. that. We telling but, you to believe. Uh, you said what I uh, before this tournament, I went to compete in um the Hall of Fame tournament, and I did, and I placed first place in Virginia Jiu Jitsu. I took first place in point um uh, kickbox. I mean point um uh, taekwondo, uh, in two different divisions. So I placed first place in two different divisions. Then I also took first place against uh, uh, continuous sparring for Taekwondo, and that was in the Hall of Fame. Uh, I also took uh, first place in a uh, in a recent um, Taekwondo tournament, like two weeks before this tournament. Uh, I took first place in that. Then I came here to fifth in kickboxing. Uh, I took first in point kickboxing in the world. And now next month, uh, I'm planning on going to do another Taekwondo tournament. And, you know, with law of attraction, believe in yourself. Write it on a piece of paper. Here it come. Believe in yourself. You got to have it. You gotta, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Belief will change your world. Belief will change your world, regardless of whatever you believe in. But like I said, you have to have a vision. And if you don't have one, if you can't see it before you have it, you have to know that you have it before you actually physically have it but you have to believe that you physically have it do you get what i'm saying it's not hard to believe that it's really not it's really not you know um you might be wondering what's on my shirt uh this is the power of dad program that i was in um the very first program ran by brian pruitt himself uh this program is 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 designed for young men who don't have fathers in their lives and um, I was a young man who didn't have a father in his life, and um, I'm 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 gonna be mentoring these young men um, in September. I'm really excited about that because, like I said, I didn't have a father in my life. So being in this program it allowed these these gentlemen, these older men, to come into my life and teach me something I had no idea about, and allow me to grow from that. Allow me to pick up on their success and their energy, their positive energy and these role models and and me coming out this program, I can get I can give back to the young men who didn't have a father. That would be stingy of me. <laughs> that would really be stingy of me, knowing that you have gave me all this knowledge and I won't give nothing back to anybody that's that's coming up behind me. That's wrong. Like, what type that's, of person that stingy. make me? That's stingy. That's, that's You are stingy. wrong for that. You are that's wrong. Stingy. If you have knowledge and you don't want to give it to anybody else because yeah. you, you feel like they might outdo you or something like that or they might grow better than you, maybe you need to step your game up. You need to, you need to, you need to, you need to reflect. You need to reflect. Because a lot of mistakes, like us, we came out with a motivation video a while back, and uh, a lot of mistakes are made because of. Some of the adults scared to teach the younger people the mistakes they made. They don't want to be outdone. Because they, they don't want to be outdone. They feel like, oh, I live my life. I'm good. Well, if you're good, see somebody else your good so the good can continue. You know, that's what we need. To, that's what we need. Stop being stingy with what you know and teach. If anybody, not one person hit, text me or wrote me on Facebook and that asked for help, or even behind it that they asked for help that we have not replied and said we will help you out. We might not be there physically, but we'll be there with a, we'll leave you in the right direction. You and that's helping out. Not whether than just not responding back and oh man, that's irritating. Help people out, stop. I don't care. We don't even have no money, which is the sad thing about it. We don't even 
It's people out here that really got money and don't even help 